Sorry, it's DJ. <laughs> Good morning, grade 5 learners! Are you ready to learn something today? For today's video, I will be discussing about finding the circumference of a circle. Let us have a review first. Fill in the blanks with the correct answer. The distance around the circle is length. Great! The answer is circumference. A line that passes through the center of a circle is length. Good job! The answer is diameter. Diameter is a line segment that divides the circle into two equal parts. An estimate of the value of pi is blank. You're right! The answer is 3.14 or 3 and 14 hundredths. One half of the diameter of a circle is blank. The answer is radius. The formula for finding the circumference of a circle is blank. You did it! The answer is circumference is equal to 2 pi r or circumference is equal to pi times d. Let us read and analyze. Mom Rona, Reese teacher, saw Piolo and his daughter measuring the distance around a circular fish pond. She told the two that it would be easier to get the circumference by measuring first the diameter or the radius of the pan. The teacher left and Reese helped her father measure the pan. If the diameter is 4 meters and the radius is 2 meters, what is the circumference of the circular pan? Number one question, what is asked in the problem? Number two, how would they solve for the circumference if they use the measurements of its radius and diameter? Again, circumference is the distance around the circle and we use these formulas to solve it. Circumference is equal to pi times d, where pi is equal to 3.14 or 3 and 14 hundredths or 22 sevenths, and d is the diameter. Circumference is equal to 2 times pi times r, where pi is equal to 3.14 or 22 sevenths. And R is the radius. Now that we have understood the concepts of the different terms involved, let us solve for the circumference of this fish pond. C is equal to pi times D. C is equal to 3.14 times 4. C is equal to 12. 0.56 meters or 12 and 5600 meters. The circumference of this fish pond is 12.56 meters. Let us use the other formula and radius as the given. Using the formula with the radius, 
C is equal to 2 times pi times R. C is equal to 2 times 3.14 times 2. C is equal to 6.28 times 2. C is equal to 12.56 meters. Using the other formula, the circumference of this fish pond is 12.56 meters. What can you notice on the two answers? Yes, they are the same. But why are the answers the same? Is it because one half of four is two and the half of the diameter is equal to radius? Let us try some exercises. For exercise 1, complete the table below. Use pi in finding the circumference of the circle. For exercise 2, fill in the table. Use pi is equal to 3.14 in finding the circumference of the circle. For exercise 3, find the radius and circumference of a circle if its diameter is 34.24 inches. Use pi equals 3.14. Congratulations! You really did well! Check your answers on the exercise using the answer key found at the last part of this video. Review if necessary before you proceed to assessment.
What is the formula in finding the circumference of a circle? To find the circumference of the circle, use the formula C is equal to 2 pi r or C is equal to pi times D. For your assessment, complete the table below. Use pi in finding the circumference of the circle. If you got it right, good job! That ends our lesson. See you next time! Thank you for watching and listening. Bye!